Hello everyone. My name is Yosef Derbao. I am with the School of Information Technology Management at Ryerson University. The title of my poster is Towards Machine Learning Decision Support Systems for Oncology. The poster reports on work in progress about the application of machine learning to improve oncology decision making. In particular, the research explores a general framework, framework for the integration of machine learning algorithms in the workflow of cancer treatment decision making. An increasingly large amount of clinical data about patient treatments and outcomes are being continuously collected and stored in electronic health record systems in oncology clinics. Machine learning driven by such data treasure trove has the potential to fuel the vision of rapid learning systems for cancer care. Indeed, given the limitations of on human limitation of human cognitive capacity to make decisions involving large numbers of variables and the expanding space of clinical data and treatment options, the application of machine learning and AI in general to assist cancer treatment decision making has the potential to improve cancer care by enabling personalized precision treatment approaches. The proposed LDSS or framework or, or lear uh, learning decision support system framework rests on the need for data platforms and decision-making process architectures that are sufficiently flexible, adaptive, and open in order to integrate continuous advances in the application of AI and machine learning to the expanding world of clinical, omics, and radiomics data which are increasingly diverse in nature and sources of origin. The proposed learning decision support system framework for oncology rests on the integration of the decision-making process with a data platform architecture. This latter is conceived to serve the following cardinal elements of decision-making in oncology namely patient health state monitoring, prediction of treatment outcomes and toxicity, adaptive treatment recommendations. The multitude of potential progression scenarios of cancer as a function of the evolving genetic and epigenetic diversity of tumors and applied treatment modalities necessitate the consideration of patient health state dynamics in the development of treatment strategies. In this respect, the proposed le uh, learning decision support system framework relies on a patient health state monitoring model in the form of a finite state machine whose states are mapped to the RESIST guidelines. Deep neural networks are selected as the machine learning approach of choice for the predictions of treatment toxicity and treatment outcomes based on an input vector of biomarkers, patient disease features, and selected treatments. The data required to train these deep neural networks are expected to be available from electronic health record systems and tumor sequencing, sequencing databases. The third element of the proposed LDSS architecture could be a sequential decision-making algorithm, such as the, the, the Q-learning algorithm, to provide adaptive treatment recommendations based on the dynamic patient health state and treatment outcomes and toxicity predictions. The effectiveness of the proposed linear, uh, learning decision support system framework 
depends heavily on the quality and volume of relevant data sourced from AHR systems and tumor sequencing databases. Furthermore, as new patient data are continuously generated and novel biomarkers validated for use along with new diagnostic and imaging data types being collected, the machine learning kernel of the LDSS or of the, uh, of the learning decision support system needs to be continuously retrained and updated. In the long run, realizing the potential utility of learning de decision support systems to cancer care will require electronic health record system interoper interoperability standards. In addition to such standards, data governance frameworks will also be needed to address patient consent, regulatory procedures, and ethical consideration considerations in order to effectively leverage the value of data being collected in hospitals and clinics to improve cancer care. Thank you.